country by the muse, for the muse and with the muse is coming back. And that's why Aidan's patience is really paying off. He's, um, somebody didn't call it patience, I think it was something like um, willful defiance, I think was the phrase. But he, you need a little bit of willful defiance. It's a very short quote. <coughs> the city is built to music. Therefore, never built at all, and therefore, built forever. I think Aiden is making music that is being built forever, that will last forever. He is literally our greatest living poet. Please welcome and enjoy Aiden Andrew Dunn. Thank you, Philip, for those warm words. I can't say how moved I am and how happy I am, ladies and gentlemen, to be here this evening with you at the birth of McCool. <laughs> yes. McCool, chapter 7. Knightsbridge, something you lack, strikes us from shop front sun mirror, light making a sudden attack, its liberation getting nearer. A perfumed emporium dazzles, yet something in appearance puzzles. What is this vacuity, this glaring incongruity? We're alienated here. Glitter blinds us at noon, confusion modern anxiety and delusion. This is why the world is bitter. Some have all, and others none. There, my entire tale is done. so much for being here.